here we have our del is from 23, 5, 3, 4, 8. We're going to open up and explore the insides. You probably realize this looks exactly the same as the del Optimex 930 because it is the same thing. So we're going to put it down. We're going to lie on something flat. There's a button under the leg. Press the button and tilt the leg up and it comes off. This is tool free. You don't need any tools to remove anything in here for this disassembly. So there's two buttons, sliding buttons at the bottom. Put it until it's um, the red dot shows up. So now we just lay it back down. Just put your big hand there and lift it up. It's a bit hard, you might require more force to remove it. So I'll just remind you again, this is tool free. You don't need any tools to remove it. They made everything with buttons and stuff like that, so you can remove. So for the DB drive, there's a button here. By pressing it down, you can remove the DB drive. So here's the button for the motherboard cover, but we're going to remove the RAM cover first. This is easy access, turn off the RAM. Reveals two slots. It's easier just to remove the motherboard cover to access the RAM anyway. I think the hole is pretty small. So you push down the button, slide it open, comes off. So here's the RAM. Push away the two sides and the RAM pops up. Now we're going to remove the hard drive, same with the hard drive, push the button down, pull it back, the hard drive comes off. So that's the wireless card, that's the CPU underneath it. This is where the graphic card goes, my one doesn't have a graphic card so they leave it blank. That's the power supply. And that's about it. Thanks for watching. This disassembly is relatively really easy as you require no tools to open it up. They made it really easy to disassemble it and access anything you need to access or access anything you should access. So stuff like the power supply which is should not be accessed is held down by screws but that's basically it. Thanks for watching.